Lift your hands everywhere you are. I declare the release tonight of this fresh fire. Thank you, Master. Mercy is released upon you. You will not be consumed. The enemy will not destroy you. Judgment is released for the enemy. Those who want you wasted, you shall see their wastage. Father, thank you for delivering this person from this eye affliction, conjunctivitis. Whether it's keratoconjunctivitis, venal conjunctivitis, or whatever it is. Redness, itching, blurry of vision. I declare it over right now. Abdominal condition within digestion is healed. Nasal condition blocking the breathing with nasal polyps is melted right now. Ovarian cyst is healed. Endometriosis. Let us at endometrial polyps. I declare you are uprooted right now. Whatever my father in heaven has not planted, it's caused. I see God healing also. I see him healing cancer. And I see him healing somebody who had the two together. Like a, a, a peptic ulcer disease, a stomach cancer, or a peptic ulcer disease with a, a, a liver cancer, just coexisting together. In the name of Jesus, I cause death in your body. Anywhere you are watching from all around the world, and any death is in your system, it is cursed right now in the name of Jesus. I see the healing of diabetes, and I see the healing of hypertension, high blood pressure, and I see the two heal together. And this too is from an ancestral lineage, father, mother, both diabetic and hypertensive. Today, I declare it is cause to his roots, blood sugar returned to normal, blood pressure returned to normal. In the name of Jesus, God is giving brand new kidneys. End stage kidney disease is being healed right now. I declare deliverance from dialysis. Kidney transplant shall not happen. In the name of Jesus, I take authority over respiratory attack. Attack on breathing. You shall not lose your life. You shall not lose your child. You shall not lose your husband. You shall not lose your wife to so this respiratory attack more at the night. I retrieve it. I refire it back to hell. In the name of Jesus, congestive cardiac failure is healed. Heart failure is healed. Allergies, that is more of allergy to eating food. I take authority. I take authority over lactose intolerance. Dairy products almost trying to kill you. I arrest it right now. In the name of Jesus Christ. I take authority over this cover of darkness. Where the enemy put you in darkness and you find yourself in the darkness, even in the dream of the night. And, and light is off everywhere, you are not finding your way. I declare this darkness destroy the light shines in darkness and the darkness comprehend it not. Now in the name of Jesus, I take authority over this spider web attack. I set it on fire right now. Even today you find yourself in that spider web. I take authority. I see a spider getting out of somebody right now as I speak. Everywhere the enemy set a, a, a trap for you. I declare the trap. That's right. Everywhere they set a trap for you, they set a snare for you. Those who set the trap for you, the trap shall catch themselves. In the name of Jesus. Money you gave that they are trying to use against you for diabolic purpose. Points of contact the enemy took from you. Wherever they took them to, I declare it is reversed. Whatever they have tried to use your thing against you about, I declare the reversal it backfires to hell. In the name of Jesus, I take authority over this dwarfish devil, this short devil that is limiting your life and limiting your destiny. You feel the presence and you see it in your dreams. I speak to everybody, but I speak to somebody all the way from East Africa around Kenya that is battling with this short devil devil within the last seven days you've seen it a couple of times i take authority over that altar i set it on fire right now in the name of jesus i declare your liberty and now the lord is canceling a handwriting of odd verdict a, a handwriting like a verdict uh, like a verdict against you in an office a verdict in court a verdict somewhere something written against you to work against you in the realms of diabolism where they have written down uh, like a decrease and verdicts against your life and your destiny I stand by the speakings of the blood of Jesus I declare the verdict is cancelled handwriting of ordinances nullified 
in the name of Jesus. I see a breakthrough mantle where the Lord is saying, energy to finish, energy to conclude is released upon you. In the name of Jesus, energy to finish, energy to conclude. Whatever journey you started and the devil say you should not finish it, that devil is arrested. Whatever progress project you have laid your hands on, and the devil says it should not be accomplished, that project is arrested. That 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 satanic agenda is arrested. Energy to finish, energy to finish, energy to finish. Receive in the name of Jesus. As I speak right now, you understand what I'm saying because somebody that is your major program, that's your major desire tonight. Energy to finish. And now delay over delay in the release of a document delay in the release of a payment just that delay it is almost ready all the time for the last one month one week one year you are almost there and then never there the delay is over you almost shared the testimony then it didn't enter your hands again the delay is over so shall it be somebody believe something happened to you today say amen in case you didn't get your word here is your word they looked up to him and they were lightened and their faces were not ashamed whatever you are looking up to God for tonight it is done shame is cancelled expectation is released and you shall testify tomorrow night is entitled revival fire that is spiritual fire but but beyond that everything else that need to be revived in the days of Nehemiah, the stones of the building were revived. There was the revival of the wall of Jerusalem. It was, it was a revival. That building was called a revival. The enemy collapsed it, but God revived it. Maybe your business needs a revival. Maybe your marriage needs a revival. But above all, maybe your ministry needs a revival. Your spiritual life needs a revival. Tomorrow night, is revival fire thank god it is happening on the lord's day the sunday and we proceed in the evening invite all your friends around the world that anything that need to be revived will be revived tomorrow lift your hands and give the lord the praise everywhere you are watching around the world in need of surrender to jesus need forgiveness for your sins place your hand on your chest and pray after me and say lord jesus i come before you today come into my life and make me a new person today I have decided to follow you Lord and no turning back from today I go forward ever backward never thank you Lord in the name of Jesus everyone who prayed that prayer wherever you are please let, let's know you prayed and let's have your names and pray in agreement with you so stretch your two hands in front of you and I prophesy upon your hands that your harvest will look for you from the north, the south, the east and the west. Whatever is yours that the devil is holding is released into your hands. In Jesus' precious name. Amen.